Hello, my name is Whitney, and today we are going to be making fairy houses out of popsicle sticks. So, before we get started, let's make sure we have everything that we need. First up, you will need popsicle sticks. Who knew? Um, a marker is optional if you would like to decorate your popsicle sticks, but not necessary. A pen, although you could just use the marker. Glue. Um, I would recommend a glue gun if you have it. I do not. This works pretty well. Um, takes a little bit longer, but it will get the job done. Scissors. And some rocks. Note how tiny they are. Don't go throwing them at people. Um, it helps to have a variety, but if you only have one, that's great. Once you have all that together, um, let's get started. All right. So to start, we're going to grab a handful of popsicle sticks. We are going to use six, and they are going to make the basis for our door. There. Six. After that, we're going to need two more, and we're going to lay them across like that. Next, grab your pen. And we are going to mark the edges. Um, I recommend doing this before and not after. So keep that in mind. Beware of any flying projectiles, especially if you're doing this with other people. Bonus points. <laughs> if you lose your pieces instead of the end. All right. So once all of that's been done, just double check. Looks pretty good. I'm using a glue stick. I don't really recommend it for this project, but I also don't have anything better on hand. Um, so if you don't either, great. It will work just fine in a pinch. Um, if you do have a glue gun, that is what I'd recommend. Um, if your parents happen to have Gorilla Glue around, ask. But it would also work very well. Keep in mind that these are fairies, so if everything isn't perfect, that is 100% A-OK. -okay. Especially if you use purple glue. They love purple glue. Okay. So I'm going to caution you right now, if you are using a glue stick, it's not going to be 100% dry for a little while, so um, be careful with this next step. This one, we take our last glue stick and lay it diagonally. Now you have a couple of choices. You don't have to cut it at all. I'm going to. So mark again the edge where it's going to hit that crossbar. Create some more projectiles. Slather on some more glue. And nail it down. Fantastic. Now the last part is one of my favorites. You're going to need a teeny tiny rock. I found mine in my garden. If you ask nicely maybe the fairies will deliver some to you. Who knows. If you have a glue gun you can also I think make a blob of glue and color it. That could also work. I like rocks personally. Now, of course, the hard part about trying to do this with a glue stick, as I am, well, glue sticks don't stick really well to rocks. Who knew? I did. It's a lie. 
All right, so you'll have to give that one a little while to dry, but this is all you need for the fairy door. Popsicle sticks, a rock, scissors, a pen, and glue. If you have markers, moss, or fairy helpers, it will look much prettier than mine, and I look forward to seeing yours in the comments. And that is how you make a fairy door. I hope you had fun today. I look forward to seeing um, all the things that you can make with this. I hope you share and join us next week for our next craft. Thank you.